Hey, hey everyone, it is five o'clock and it's Sunday, so it's time for So Sweet Sunday. Well, it has been um, a great weekend. Stay tuned and I'll tell you about it. Stay tuned and I'll tell you about it. So let me share everywhere we share to, it's So Sweet to Learn, So Sweet Academy, my chaotic embroidery brown and brown girl crafters are created stitching straps embroidery Booms, vinyl, and more. Um, oh, that was another one. I can't remember the other one. Oh, teaspoon of sugar. Um, okay, so we'll stop there. Hey, Mom. Hey, Zaranda. Hey, Marla. Hey, Samantha. Uh oh, let's go y'all away. Hey, Angela. So let's get, let's let's get into some good news spirit first, and then I just had some randomness that just happened that I'm gonna need a hug for. Okay, I'm gonna need a hug for it. Seriously. Like, um, first of all, so sweet Academy. Oh, that's so sweet. The five day stitchathon is back and it's starting tomorrow. Um, the link is above if you want to learn more and join us. Also, so basically what that is, let me give you a brief overview really quickly. Basically what that is, that is five days of us hopping on Zoom in the evening. No, we're not gonna be stitching around the clock. I know what you're thinking, stitchathon. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, I'm stitching all day, I don't have time for this. No, 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 no. We're gonna learn some really cool things. Let's see if I can turn this light down. Um, Nana's in the house. Um, hey, Miss Shirley. Hey, Evelyn. So we'll be learning some really cool, um, techniques. I think I just added hats to it because last week, I don't remember who it was, but last week somebody was like, oh, we need to learn hats. So I was like, okay, we'll do hats, but, um, we'll definitely be perfecting our placement. We'll be learning about, um, all the fundamentals of embroidery and everything. So if you're a beginner or if you're not a beginner, you just kind of want some stitch help, hop in, um, click the link above to learn more and find out about that. Next. So I just like, literally y'all, I, I just landed and I took a 10 minute nap, which is part of the reason why I'm late. Took a little 10 minute nap and um, it was the bomb though. I just came from um, Tampa. I was at Tops Back and Sewing in Tampa, Florida and I met an amazing group of ladies and owners and we basically went through um, a lot of the fun stitch outs on the, the 10 needle and the six needle and then we learned some things on the skin and cut. Yes, yes, y'all. I'm gonna be a pro at the skin and cut soon. Um, so we learned some stuff on the skin and cut. So obviously I'm gonna bring that to you all. I couldn't do it today because I didn't have enough time to plan. As a matter of fact, I don't even have, I don't have anything planned for you all today. I don't. I went in my closet and I found a denim jacket and we're gonna play with some of the designs on here, which is how I found out my new devastating news. Okay, y'all, do y'all wanna know why I need a hug? Because, okay, let me tell you this real quick. Can y'all, can y'all just give me this moment and just be a friend for me because, uh, your girl, just, I, okay, so the other day, I was in my house, my air is on, and I heard, um, I heard something, and I was like, what in the world is that? And I figured it was my air conditioner. So, I didn't think anything else of it because it stopped. Well, you know, I've been out of town for the whole weekend, came home, it was a little warm, so I turned my air, air up or down or whatever you do to get it to blow more cold air. It started blowing. I'm laying over here taking my little nap, you know, trying to get a little shut eye, checking the inside of my eyelids for holes. And next thing you know, I was like, well, what is going on? I keep hearing that sound again. So I get up to walk into my hallway and I see, because I have hardwood floors. I changed my carpet out to hardwood floors a couple years ago. And I see a bubble up in my hardwood floor. And I'm like, God, I know what that means. There's water somewhere. 
So I opened my closet on top of, you know, like the little air conditioner closet part, on top of the unit that has the um, air filter. And lo and behold, it's like dripping. I don't mean it's dripping. I mean like it is dripping, dripping, like a constant drip. Like I just didn't know what to do. So I literally closed the door, y'all, and I'm, I'm, I'm not a crier, but I feel like crying right now. Um... I literally just closed the door and I came down on live with y'all. That's it. So y'all are y'all are living life with me in real time. Uh, I put a towel. Okay, I did put a towel in there because I didn't want to hear it dripping because that was gonna just give me even more anxiety. So once we're gonna once we get off here, I will be calling or texting the guy that did my AC unit a couple years ago to see if he can come out and check it tomorrow. So there's that. So I need a hug. Cause I'm, I'm legit sad because not only, not only two things. So first thing that worried me, I'm like, crap, it's going to be hot. I'm in the South. It's about to be hot. I mean, it is hot. What if my air goes out? Second thing, uh, I was like, oh my gosh, that, that drip sounds like a lot of money. Third thing, my floor is ruined in that area. And it's like real hardwood floor. It's not like the little laminate that I probably should have gotten, but I was, I thought I was being all fancy getting hardwood floors, but so yeah, I'm sorry that happened. I'm sure everyone would understand if you, no, 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 listen, y'all, I, I did not, Angela, I, I get it. I know y'all would understand if I needed to skip today, but I needed to not skip today. Like after that happened, I was like, I need y'all, like I need y'all. Okay. My mom is on here. My dad will probably pop on. Like I need y'all are, y'all are my support. So otherwise I would probably like literally start crying and stressing out right now. But I'm not gonna cry. I'm here, we're here, we're here. When all else fails, we stitch, okay? So mom, when I get off of here, I'm calling you because I need some mommy support. But nonetheless, um, how are y'all doing today? How are y'all doing? Are y'all having a good day? I hope y'all are having a good day. I mean, my day is not bad. This is not worst case scenario. This is gonna get fixed. Uh, it's gonna it's gonna work out. It, I mean, it has to work or it has to work. Remember, we adopted that the other day. It has to work or it has to work. And then, um, we gonna make it do what it do, baby. But yes, yeah, so we're gonna stitch on a jacket. Like I said, I don't have a design. I'm literally just gonna pull up a design on here. Um, the jacket is not for anyone in particular. It's just a jacket that I had in my closet. If you all have been watching me long enough, you know that um, you remember when we did this. Remember when we did this? So if y'all have been watching me long, and as a matter of fact, this file is on my Etsy shop. So if you've been watching me long enough, you remember when we did this. And this jacket is just a random jacket. I thought it was going to fit me. Yeah, we need to laugh. Let's laugh real quick. I thought this was jacket was going to fit me. And it did fit me when I first bought it a little bit. But, ugh. <laughs> oh, it does not fit me. So, I don't I don't know who this, I don't know who this jacket is. And this is my air, or airport outfit, y'all. So, it kind of looked like borderline. I was traveling home in my pajamas. But, <laughs> Okay, hold on, hold on, hold, hold. <laughs> I gotta first stop laughing to show y'all, okay? <laughs> I'll cut off circulation. <laughs> I'm gonna get stuck. Who is gonna come? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna sit back. <laughs> it probably shrank in the wash. You're right, Deborah. Only I didn't wash it. <sighs> it shrank in the 2020 COVID. <laughs> okay. You got know, big man and a little co Okay. All right. So this is what we're gonna stitch today. What are y'all saying? It's because of COVID. I'm telling you. Listen, raise up your arms. April, you got jokes, okay? You got jokes, April. <laughs> okay, so. All right, and it's hot in here because you were, oh, it's hot. Hold on. Whoa, baby. Whoa, baby. 
<laughs> Y'all play too much. You really do. You really do. When you pass out, don't say nothing. Exactly. Luckily, I have water close by. Okay? Let me turn the fan on because it's hot. It's hot. Let me turn the fan on. <laughs> I needed some, I needed some, um, I needed some giggles. All right. That was, <laughs> I can't with y'all. Okay. Anywho. So let's figure this out. So we are going to, so once I started um, with brother as an educator, I, before that, I didn't really use a lot of my designs on my machine. That's nice. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I missed some of the comments. Okay, I think I'm caught up. Um, so I, I, I didn't really appreciate some of the designs on here, um, my, my machine. I have the PE 800, but as you all know, there are a lot of newer machines that are out with a ton of more designs. So, I think I need to just start showing some love to my preloaded designs because they're pretty cool. So let's see. I don't, I mean, like I said, I don't have anyone in particular for this. So we're just, this is just going to be our play jacket. Hopefully, well, well, it's not really going to match because I'm probably going to do something. I don't know. We'll see. So this one right here kind of has like the gold and stuff and love and Africa with a crown, but maybe and you know i have all this thread back here woohoo all that thread so we have plenty to play around with we just have to find a design so what say ye we just turn the machine on find a design and go for it like that's kind of how my life is going right now like when you don't really know what to do you just turn the machine on do something and go for it okay are y'all with it if y'all missed the beginning which we just started a moment ago um make sure you watch the replay uh, and you'll know. Okay? I'll probably mention it again because it's bothering me, but nonetheless. Nonetheless. Oh, but what I do want to tell you all, I was while I was laying there like halfway taking my nap, I was thinking of what to say when we got on here. And um, one of the things that came to mind was if you have a local... Um, if you have a local brother dealer, tell them that you all want some training and um, myself or one of the other educators, we come out. Like, that's how it works. We come out. I didn't know it was that easy until I started. Like, we come out. So, um, to host different events and it's super fun. It's super fun. We had a two-day event there and um, y'all. I don't know if y'all know how awesome y'all are, but to just see some of the things that you all make, like quilts and um, purses. This one lady, she made a whole outfit similar to this with her serger, because you know, brother has the new um, our new serger out. But I'm like, I I know how to stitch stuff on a serger, but I don't know how to stitch stuff on a serger. Like growing up, my mom always did the stuff that we needed on the surgery she always threaded it for us so if i was to have a, yes jamie call jeff i spoke to jeff the other day while we were at um b2b so he definitely would be having some some events coming up soon we have um we had a little conversation we need to have a follow-up one but yeah so that's that's our local dealer here and if you all have a local dealer in your area i probably either met them or saw them at the event and I mean, I gotta say, they're pretty awesome. They're some pretty awesome people. You know what? My Eric had the nerve to just hop to pop back on. So this is my dilemma. Herein lies my dilemma. Have you done an event at Jeff's? Jocelyn, I have not. Not yet. Not yet, but stay tuned. I definitely will. And something tells me y'all will be there. But um what's it? I forgot what I was about to say. Uh, combined with the little bit of fatigue from from travel, but I feel I feel overall. I mean, I, I felt like I could take a little nap, but I feel good. 
because I, and all y'all, yeah, all I'm doing right now is just I'm hooping. I'm hooping my stabilizer. Um, do I want to hoop my jacket? I think I'll hoop my jacket. But I gotta stop. I gotta stop stopping mid thought because I'm forgetting what I'm saying. Um, but I flew there and then flew back here to Augusta, so I'm not super duper tired. Not super super duper tired. Um, it might be beneficial for me to pick my design first, so I'll know what to do. I'm glad you thought we're gonna have a call. call. I know, <laughs> y'all are funny. Um, Jamie Angela said that she thought y'all were gonna have to come over here and and get the jaws of life to get me out of this jacket. You would have been quicker than. <laughs> All right, so hopefully you can't see the mess over there on the other side of the living room, but. Let's see what we have. And I can't move too far right here because my phone needs charging from the airport. So, okay, I don't want words. Hey, Miss Brenda. Hey, Fanny. So we have 14 designs on here. What, what say ye? It's, I'm just gonna go out on them right now and tell y'all it's not gonna match the front at all not at all not at all that butterfly looks nice we might do the butterfly if all those fails that butterfly might be the move what's this oh this one's cute we might do that one because I can do like browns and stuff. And it's symmetric. Y'all know me in symmetry. <laughs> Jamie said, Lord, I would like listen, I know you would have. Y'all <sighs> that that would have been hilarious. He lied to us. Okay, so I'm, I'm torn, but I don't really know what this is. I can't really tell what that is. So, what was the first option we had? Was it on this screen? Oh, it was this one. I'm gonna do this one, y'all. It kind of listen. Okay, don't, don't, don't judge me. But I mean, I'm gonna do this one, but it kind of looks like a uterus. <laughs> with little floating tubes there but anyway I'm going to do that one it's kind of cute it's kind of cute because otherwise there's okay so let's vote there's this one or there's the butterfly or the butterfly y'all vote y'all vote while I um Oh, it's not too big either. So the butterfly is, we can probably make it bigger. Um, 2.9 by 3.15. And the other one is 2.6 by 3.93. All right, I'm seeing a lot more butterflies. Butterfly, butterfly in the sky. I can go twice as high. All right, let's see if we can size it out. What's the biggest we can get this, buddy? All right, that's it. That's it, that's all we get. 3.48 by 3.78. Y'all know what I love about this? Uh, we can make it bigger and it adjusts the stitches and everything. Um, edit. I'm just playing with some stuff here, y'all. Because ever since I've been playing with a lot of the other machines, I am learning. Okay, so listen. Okay, this, okay, make sure now. Because the butterfly that background is solid and everything else in here is colorful okay y'all cool with that the background is solid so now we got to pick colors we need at least 
uh, one, two, three, four colors. So something solid, and I want it to be earthy. Oh, oh. All right, so we have this rose gold, rose gold. So maybe rose gold. Um, it's calling for a white. Hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put them all up here. Rose gold, white. We need like a brown, like a brown, brown, brown. Ooh, I like where this is going. We need a brown. I don't know which is gonna be what. Okay, so we got rose gold. So maybe, okay, so maybe the brown is gonna be the base. Rose gold is gonna be one of the colors on the inside of it. Um, hmm. These little stickers come off the bottom of it, it drives me crazy. Okay, brown, rose gold. All right, so let's move this out of the way so we don't make a mistake. And I want it to be, so it is, it's very earthy, y'all. It's it's gonna be very muted. Brown, okay, we need one more color. Um, um, let me visualize it, hold, hold, up, hold please. All right, so brown underneath, rose gold. It's gonna be there and there, white is there. I might need something with a little pop, like a rust. Rusty. We need a rusty. Rusty. Ooh, no. Yeah. Let's do a. Um. No. 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 Nah. yellow and white so that could be like the little flower because otherwise it's like a darker brown I think that dark brown is too dark for the other one it's like a yellowish oh well okay so we'll we'll do this one that uh, I don't know that's far away from but see, I did a pink. Like, you mean like a hot pink, Jamie? Or like a pinker pink? A pinker pink. Ugh, y'all, my unit just, like, came on and went off again. I'm, I'm nervous, okay? I'm nervous. I'm a little nervous. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. I think it'll be okay. I don't, I don't know what to do. All right, pink. Maybe a darker brown. Okay. 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 All right. I don't, I don't like where this is going. Pink or pink? Okay. So we don't need it till last. All right. That's the good thing about it. So. Um, that's the last color. So let's just stitch it out and see what we get. See what we get. And then we'll decide from there. Deal? Deal. All right. Good. I'm glad y'all agree. So on second thought, I don't think I'm going to float it. I mean, um, hoop it because what's happening is it's right on the way the, the hoop is. It's going to be right on this seam right here and it's going to be a little thick. So I don't want to have to fight with that today. Um, so let's just go ahead and float, float on. All right. Let's see, maybe I can show y'all a little bit. Why is this so wrinkly? Okay, okay, okay. 
Y'all know me, I am a stickler for this here grid. If you don't know where your grid is, you need to find it. Because as you know, or may not know, these notches, that is not your center. The notches, that's not your, the notch is not your, notch is not your center. Not your center. I also need display adhesive. Don't know what that is. I do know. I borrowed it for the back room. Um, let me grab my spray adhesive. Y'all remember when production used to help me out? I guess I fired production. I need production staff. Production! I'll put this jacket back on when I'm done too. Maybe I will have lost a pound. All right, um, I'm gonna use a little bit of spray adhesive, just a little bit. Never spray it in the direction of your machine um, because you don't wanna gunk up your needle or anything or your machine. So, y'all know when I'm doing this for myself and not really a tutor tutorial, I don't really do any major measuring. Kind of wing it. Um, let's see which way we want to do this. So if this were on like uh, my 650, not my 680W, I could um, I could use my smart placement tool, but it's not. So. We do it this way. We do it this way. And then we pin it. So the good thing about this, it's denim, so it's pretty thick. It's not gonna be slipping and sliding all over the place. And, 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 and. works out better. Think of, what, what else can we talk about, y'all? Um, oh, so, guess what? The graduating class of 20, of 2002, this year is our 20-year reunion, and I am fortunate enough to be affiliated with two graduating classes of 2002, because I started off my educational career in Lake City, Florida, and I made a bunch of friends there, and I was like loving all of their pictures because they had their reunion last night, well, over the weekend. 
And if I had known ahead of time, I probably would have gone. Or, well, I couldn't because I was teaching. But I would have at least, um, I was in Florida, so I could have popped into it or something. But 20 years, y'all. 20 years. I can't believe it. I mean, I feel like I just graduated from high school last year. That's, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. It ain't been no 20 years. It was just 2022 ago. That's it. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. All right, so let's, on a serious note, let's find a little bit of a center. Let's get a little bit of a center here. Um, typically I would use a tape measure or something. Something. But um, it's in my other studio. So we're just gonna go rogue. Okay. All right. So we're gonna have to go back because we gotta find our placement. Yikes. gonna be real muted. I probably should have picked some colors. Welcome to inside of my brain you guys. That's so fun. Y'all literally see inside my brain every week when I when I do these stitch outs because literally embroidery and business is all I think about. Um, I mean, my family too, that's a given, but you know what I mean. That that goes without being said, right? Um, but just the, the sheer beauty of um, going along with it and just figuring out the colors as I go, figuring out the design, getting the placement right, all of that fun stuff, okay. So my phone was going dead. Hopefully, get it close enough without. Right, so we'll just take this off. We gotta charge it later. I'll put it back in there. Okay. Okay. So we gotta rotate it because I put it on there sideways. We're using the big hoop. Um. Oh, too fast. Let's find our placement. Let's go up some. I want it fairly high. And then, whoa, get back here. Okay, that looks good. That looks good. Oh, this is gonna be a small butterfly. Give me a butterfly saying. What's a butterfly saying I can say? Fly high butterfly? I don't know. Someone give me a give me a quick little butterfly saying that I might be able to add to this. That's as high up as I can go. I would look one up right now, but I'm kinda on live with you all. Are y'all there? Don't tell them my internet's acting up. Maybe do more than one. Not today, Miss Shirley. <laughs> Not today. Uh, that would be a good idea though. I could like to, okay, okay, I get what you're saying. So I could come back and do another one. All right, you're right. So right now let's just do one. Let's just do one. Let's just stop there. And then we're gonna go to embroidery. Now the first one is it's only an 11 minute stitch. It's only an 11 minute stitch. I mean a 16 minute stitch and the first one is 11 minutes. So the first one we were gonna do was the darker brown. Mm, that's not really a dark brown. 
this one is this is a very dark brown yeah so let's do yeah let's do this one so that this pink will pop or this rose gold will pop hello sunshine that's a good one um amelia that is a good one all right what i always love is having to find where this thread starts sometimes it's easy there we go sometimes it's not As I was threading this, y'all, <laughs> I threaded 10, not 10, six, 10 needles on Friday. Six, 10 needles. Okay, six of them. So for all of you all that, when you first got your machine and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm going to thread it. I know, I feel you. I, I feel you because I threaded six of them for, for that event that we were at. Um, it went fast though. It went really fast. It wasn't too bad. What was that? A butterfly symbolizes faith and embraces the journey. Listen, Zoranda. Well, then that that is why right now we're doing this butterfly. Because if faith, <laughs> faith is all I have at this moment. With everything that's going on, faith is what I have. And I am going to embrace this journey because there's nothing I can do. You've done all you can do. You just stand. That didn't sound good. That didn't sound good. I think I have it. Well, I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to change my bobbin in a bit. But not quite yet. Not right now. Uh -oh. The bobbin's on there, right? I think it just didn't want to go. And I'm not gonna back up because it's it's the under ones, it's the under stitches, so let's see. Oh, this is a small butterfly. Oh shoot. Well it is three. Okay. <laughs> Someone didn't listen. Oh, I know what it is. When it's going up against here, the denim part of the jacket. Okay. That's what it is. So I know butterflies sometimes are like vibrant or pastel or nice colors, but what I really wanted to do, um, I wanted, to, I wanted it to still kind of match what was on the front side. So, um, 
Now I want to get closer. Can y'all see it? Y'all need to lean in some? Lean in, lean in. Be nice, lean in. Let your neighbor see. Y'all see my box of stabilizer over there? I need to find one. Like, somewhere to, I'm gonna get like a shelf and put all of it on there. Basically what I've been doing is just pulling from that stash and using it as I need it. But I kind of need it to go somewhere. I think we may have shifted a little bit because of this piece up here. Just a smidge. And Shirley, I think you're right. I think another one would be nice, like maybe even in a different direction going down the back. thinking now, I hope it doesn't shift anymore from that. I think it'll be okay. FYI, when you're doing a jacket, if this piece is up close to the top of your hoop, it might, that might impede it a little bit. something brighter than this. Something brighter. Something less bright. Alright, our colors have officially changed. I really wanted to use that rose gold though. The white is staying. Um, I'm going to keep that white red color option, but let's put this back, and I mean now we may be able to do this variegated. So this 
this is weird, but I kind of like it. It's like a, it, it really has greens, blues, purples, yellows. I think I might do that on on that. Oh, Miss Shirley, I'm glad you said that. Yes, yes, yes. So I'm definitely going to spotlight and highlight you all that have done your homework so far. And I want to show, um, I want to show the live what the homework that you all were supposed to be doing was. So let me run, go get it so I can have it so I don't forget. This is right here. giving out snacks. I just racked up on snacks. I saved them each time. I have graham crackers. Chips. More chips. Water. More water. I had another water, but I drank And then I had the little graham cracker. Like the, um, what's that thing called? With the biscotti, biscoff, but I ate that. Stop y'all wondering. So if anybody needs a snack, okay, if anyone needs a snack, I got you covered, just let me know. I have airplane food, also some nail later. Uh oh. Um, I drank the wine. Don't, I, I'm sorry, I did not save you any of the wine that we got. But nonetheless, if you if you just if you're feeling snackish for chips, I got you. Let me know. Um, like I said, I just post mine. Oh, good, perfect. I'm probably gonna do like a cute TikTok for y'all. Hmm. Letty, yes. To answer your question, definitely, immediately, yes. I have. I love those Biscoff cookies. I love the spread. So the way I fell in love with that spread was when I was in London. They had an ice cream that had that. It was like the Biscoff cookie sticking out of it, and then they had that spread like sprinkled around. Well, not sprinkled, but you know, squeezed around in there. I think that's pretty much all that has to go up in that corner. Oh shoot, we didn't pick it. We didn't pick the other one. But um, back to the cookies. What's next? The white. All right. Back to the cookies, um, lady. So, what I usually do, I always get the cookies every time, and then when I'm in my hotel room on whatever trip I'm on, and I feel snackish in the middle of the night, then I eat them. But yes, I have had the spread. There's ice cream. There's local. There's ice cream here in the States with it too. Um, it's the bomb. It's dangerous. It's 
definitely dangerous, but it's good. I've used it instead of peanut butter. Oh my gosh, don't tell me that. So I had a DoorDash order, not DoorDash, Instacart order the other day. And I told the girl that some of that wasn't my groceries, but then we still went through it. And I thought I gave her all of the other person's stuff back, but apparently we forgot the peanut butter. So now I do have peanut butter. It's like honey something peanut butter. I never buy peanut butter. Although I love peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I should never buy peanut butter. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, do I want white or do I want like a cream color? All right, so we'll just try it with white. All right, what do we have to lose, y'all? Nothing, nothing to lose. Hey, Gil. Um, or sometimes Kira eats my airplane snacks when I, when I come back and she sees them. And sometimes I just forget that they're in my purse or my carry-on. And like a week later or something, I find it and it's like Christmas. It's like, ooh, hello. That is pretty. <laughs> okay, so now, okay, y'all, now for real, we have to decide. This one. The picture says hot pink, so let's, I mean, let's just go with this pink. It's not hot, but it's pink. <laughs> it's not hot, but it's pink. I guess what I could do is cut this jump stitch so that we don't stitch over it. Uh -oh. I'll, I'll catch the other piece later. We're gonna need this pink again because this pink is going to match the um, this side over here. And I do kind of like it. All right, and did we say we were gonna use this one that's like a, did we say that? We did, didn't we? Why is my leg itching? Okay, we did. Well, y'all didn't, but I did. I did. I mean, you could probably do this better off the machine, but you know, you know, 
if you know, you know. Sometimes we just don't. Okay? All right. Oh, I definitely did that. Mardi Gras. It's a little different. that I didn't do this um, other variegated one. This one on the other side, like I was thinking, because um, it looks like, like me that I said, that one looks real Mardi Gras. I got this candy in my mouth. Um, I didn't want that to be all over it. So I think the pink one is okay on the side. And better. All done. We're done. We're done, son. Okay. Now we gotta decide which way I want to take it off of here. It didn't cut. Oh yes, it did. I'm back. Ooh. Oh, no, this this trap. Uh -oh. This tripod is on its last leg. I know I'm worried it has three, but we iffy. Okay. That's what we got. Pants. 
see. I need to turn my lights off. It's so bright. Inside. <laughs> I don't really like the very dark side, but it's okay. It's okay. Probably should have stuck to like a solid. Taking the pins out. I'm gonna take it off of here. Hey, Dee Dee. Hey, Ann. Give me a second, let me cut the stabilizer off. I probably could use better scissors, but you know. For the sake of right now, and I used about like a medium, this was probably like a medium cutaway. I'll clean it up a little later. But it's cute. I mean, it's cute. It has personality. Personality. Y'all, I'm loving the. So, okay, look at the sheen of this thread. I like it. I like it. The light is doing it a lot of justice. It's nice. So what I may do, this might just be my project jacket. This might just be the jacket that I just stitch something on every time I don't know what to put something on. Because that's what we did last time. Like, that's how we got this. And then maybe one day, when this, when this COVID weight decides, I think that's what it, the 19 stood for, 19 pounds, y'all think so? That's what I'm going with. Um, so if y'all missed it earlier, y'all missed me trying it on. This was initially for me. I know it's for now. Then it was gonna be for Kira, I and mean, she couldn't fit it anymore. But okay. That's the back. That's the back of it. It's like tattoos for your jacket. I agree. So if you <laughs> if y'all are just joining me, I am well aware that this jacket does not fit. Okay, I'm well aware of it. Um, oh, because I'll even be able to do the sleeve one, okay, because I have a nice sleeve hoop to do, and I can do some down the side, so somebody is going to be really happy with this jacket once I get done. It's like patches without patching. You're just stitching it on there. It's a workout putting it on. <laughs> it is, Deborah. <laughs> So maybe I should just put this on every couple days or every couple hours and then it'll be, it'll be, I'm not buttoning it. If y'all want to see the button, if y'all want to see me struggling to button it, watch the beginning. Okay. Watch the beginning. And you'll, you'll, you'll find out a lot more about this live. Um, but yeah, so that's, that's that. That's what we got. That's what we got. Little shoulder, little shoulder lean. Okay. That's what we got there. That's all you got. I like it. So 
So I might even put like words underneath it and do something cute with it. I don't know, who knows? Who knows what we'll do next on it, but thank y'all for hanging out with me. Like I said, and like the comment and notes say, <laughs> I needed a hug today. I needed a hug because everything just kind of went crazy literally moments before we hopped on here. Right now, I am about to um, message my AC guy. Hopefully, he is available tomorrow. If you guys live here in the Augusta area and you know an AC guy, please text me their number because I gotta find out why my whole unit is um, pouring water. It's not just dripping, it's pouring water. And um, also, if you know a flooring guy, Send them my way because my floor is um, has bubbled where that water has absorbed and um, I'm definitely gonna need to figure that out so you guys definitely were a good distraction for me today you gave me some good laughs when I needed it Appreciate y'all. Love y'all more than you know. Thank you, Dawn. Lovely to see you also, Dee Dee. Um, but also, okay, anywho, the show must go on. So anyway, um, the five day stitch thon starts tomorrow. It starts tomorrow, tomorrow. So what I'm about to do, I have a couple more things to finish up for it. Um, I'm gonna go relax for the rest of the evening. Probably get a little, little snack. And no, I'm not gonna snack. I'm gonna be good. And then I'll be ready. I shall, look, look how, first of all, first of all, let's see this. <laughs> what made me think that this would even? There was a time pre-COVID. This could you girl could have buttoned this up. Okay, pre-COVID, this happened. But um, this is what. Oh, let me cut this jumpsuit. Oh, wait, 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 y'all. Don't go nowhere. I got something to show you. As promised, I was going to show you all what the academy, what their homework was and what they, y'all, they did their homework. It's been so long since like almost all of them did their homework. Y'all clap for them. <laughs> clap for the academy. And if you are in the academy and you did your homework, hashtag academy. So I had an idea from the dollar store that had a satin glitter patch. Thought about doing a patch or embroidery on, let's see, I can't see the bottom of it, on it. Oh, that would be cute, that would be super cute. Um, so the their homework, so the other day I was at the Dollar 25 store and I found this canvas, but I think, Academy, I think I told y'all a lie, I think I told y'all it was a Dollar 25, I'm almost sure it was um, $5, I think, I think it was $5. Let me know if you all went and got one. Um, so you said hashtag academy, but I mean, you have to say hashtag academy and then like something like I did my homework to, to let me know that you did your homework. But I went in there and I saw this canvas and I had been wanting to do this for a while. And actually I, I remembered who I was talking to about it. It was, I think it was Jeff that I was talking to about, um, doing a canvas and I finally tried it. So in the academy, boom, we did this. Boom, we did this. So it's cute, isn't it? It's giving very cute. Kira has me saying that now. Like she... That's all she says. It's giving, um, and then she says whatever it's giving. So it's cute. So I gave them a lot of ideas of what they could do with this. That was their homework. They had to do some sort of line art with this, with this. So, it, okay, you said it was a dollar. Oh, so it was a dollar. I couldn't remember. I could not remember. <laughs> Letty, yes. So basically everyone did a great job and understood the assignment. So great job. Um, and the best part about this is I'm actually adding this tutorial for this. It's in the academy, obviously, because we did it in the academy. But I'm adding this one to, my mom was calling, I think she thinks I'm off live. Um, but I'm gonna wrap up here and call her. But I'm, I'm adding this tutorial, so it won't be the one from the academy, it'll be a whole new one. I'm adding it to the actual, um, bonus section of the five day stitch -a So when you sign up for the five day stitch -a you attend, you get this, okay? You get this. Can't promise that you'll get it tomorrow. You'll get it by the middle of the week because 
um, I'm gonna actually do the tutorial and I wanna do a more detailed one. I mean, you can't get more detailed than the one I did in the academy, but I wanted to do an exclusive one for the five day stitchathon attendees too, rather than just sharing one in the academy, okay? So, boo yeah, there's that. You guys get that. The academy has already done their homework. I'm gonna do something, something cute and something special to acknowledge them. So as you all know, your homework is due tomorrow. It's always due the Monday after the Tuesday that I assigned it. So that gives y'all a whole week, okay? A whole week, y'all. I had to stop telling them it was due on Tuesday because guess what they would do? They would do it on Tuesday. They would wait till Tuesday. Don't tell them I told y'all that. I, I don't mean to tell their business. I didn't tell y'all that. They didn't do that, not in real life. They did their homework the day after they were supposed to. That's, that's exactly how it went. Um, but nonetheless, they rocked it out this time and I was in Florida and I was seeing the scrolls and seeing them tagging me on the homework and I just wish they knew how much it made my heart smile. All I could really do, all I really had time to do was just put a heart by it. Um, I made a comment on a couple of them, but just in general, all I had time to do was put a, put a heart by it and let them know that um, I truly love the fact that they were doing the homework but I am going to do something special like a TikTok or something. So if you're watching this Academy members and you have not done your homework, go ahead, hurry up and get it in between today and tomorrow because um, I want your your stitch out to be a part of the like collage thing that I do. So make sure you get it in. If you want to make, if you need to take a better picture of it, do that and just post it in there and I will see it. All right. All right. Good deal. So air hugs, everybody. Oh, what is that? Okay. Air hugs, everybody. Thank y'all so much for being here for me today. Okay. Today is when I needed you all. I didn't know I was going to need you all this much until right before I hopped on. So I appreciate you all for just making me feel better when life happens. Okay. Remember life is going to happen. That's the one thing we can't, we cannot control it. All we can, all we can do is control what, how we react to it. Okay. And if, if there's nothing you can do, you just, you know, you just keep moving, okay? All right, that's all. That's all you do. The big one was $5. The six by eight was double twenty five. Okay, so I think I did. Okay, all right, Zaranda. That's probably what I did. I think I got, because this one is 12 by 12, pretty much. I think I did get the 12 by 12 one. And that's why it was $5. Okay, gotcha. Um, but I gave y'all some really good ideas and you know, if you know, you know, you know what your assignment is, you know what the ideas were. Um, what else did I miss? All right, Amelia, hashtag Academy. Hey, Starla, Letty, hashtag Academy. Um, Zoranda said the homework was, was simple and fun. It was, y'all, I had, they needed a break, okay? They needed, a, they needed a simple one. Um, I'm gonna keep coming back to that one. And Angela's hashtag Academy. Good job. Give y'all selves a hand clap and I will see you all later. I will see you all tomorrow. See you tomorrow um, on the first night of the five day stitchathon. Okay. Oh, and um, Academy, keep a lookout on the group. I know you all are wondering um, when you guys are going to be added into the group soon. 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 Okay. Because Academy members get into the five day stitchathon for free. So soon. All right, see y'all later. Remember y'all, it doesn't have to be perfect, but it has to be pretty. Where did I get that from? You guys have seen the live. You saw the live a long time ago where I was stitching out Cannon's shirt and it turned out upside down. And I was like, oh, it's not perfect, but it's pretty. You know, he's not gonna know. He still doesn't know the difference. He's just three. He still can't really read. He talks really well. Um, and he's fluent in throwing tantrums, but he, he's not really reading yet. So he's, he's still okay with it. But that also encompasses everything about life of, it's not perfect. We just clean it up. We make it pretty. We keep moving. We do what we have to do. And um, if I'm going to say that all the time, I have to be my own living testimony. So that's it. That's what it is. Okay. I am a living testimony. So I will see you all later. Thank you all for tuning in and bye.